We are always talking about how you can get more views on your YouTube channel if you have a better understanding of your impressions and click-through rates, but it hasn't been possible to do away from a desktop until now. VidIQ. VidIQ. VidIQ.com. The first thing you will need to do is to make sure your iOS or Android version of the Creator Studio app is fully up to date. Go to either the Android Play Store or Apple App Store, search for YouTube Studio, and if it isn't up to date right now, you should get an option to update it from this screen. Now, when you open up the Creator Studio app, from the dashboard screen, tap on View More for Channel Analytics, and then tap on the Discovery tab to show you at the very top of the screen impressions and click-through rate for your entire channel over the last 28 days. Even the full desktop Creator Studio doesn't show you this side-by-side -side comparison, which can be useful to review as a snapshot how impressions affect your click-through rate. You can tap on each of these graphs to go into detail and impressions will show you a growth or decline over the last 28 days. The drop-down filter allows you to refine your results to the last seven days, but unfortunately not to the last 48 hours or 60 minutes, so it isn't quite real time, an advantage you do get through the desktop version. As well as channel impressions and click-through rate, you can view the same analytics on a video-by-video -video basis. Go to the video section of the Creator Studio app and select the video you want to view and then from this screen tap on video analytics. You'll see the same discovery tab at the top of the screen which will show you impressions and click-through rate for that one video. Hello everyone, I'm Rob and welcome back to vidIQ, the YouTube tool and channel that aims to educate you on your YouTube journey. For all of the latest YouTube tips, tricks and advice, make sure to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bell so that you're the first to be notified when we release brand new content. As always, school is in session and for those regular visitors to vidIQ, this is a different classroom because I'm on my travels and I don't have the fancy studio behind me. A quick explanation of these two analytics. Impressions is the number of times your thumbnail is seen on YouTube. You want as many impressions as possible because that's basically free advertising for your content. The click-through rate is the number of times a person clicks on a thumbnail when seen. For example, if you get 100 impressions and 10 people click on those thumbnails, that is a click-through rate of 10% and that would be considered very high and very good. The quality of your thumbnails is what usually drives your click-through rate, so for more tutorials on how to make better thumbnails, we've got a playlist over here. A lot of people have been getting very excited about these analytics finally coming to the mobile app, so check out the analytics for your channel and let us know in the comments below. Now you may be wondering why it's taken so long for these analytics to come to the mobile app when they've been on desktop for over a year. Well, to be honest, it's our fault. Well, I don't mean vidIQ's fault, but the creator community at large. YouTube are currently having to maintain both the new Creator Studio and the classic Creator Studio, and until they can pull resources off of that classic studio, they can't put them into resources that will help them create all of these analytics for the mobile application. So the quicker we can all get off a classic, which is happening very, very soon, the quicker YouTube can create more awesome tools for us on the desktop and mobile analytics for YouTube. For more YouTube beginners, guys, just like this, check out the playlist over here and if you want to learn more about vidIQ we can help you analyse videos, research YouTube and audit your own channel to help grow your presence on YouTube, check out the beginner's guide down here. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy the rest of your video making day. Oh, by the way, this is what's outside of my window. Fascinating.